Hey guys, Gavin Gear here from UltimateReloader.com. In this video, we're gonna make our own case lube. That's right, it's just alcohol, lanolin, in a spray bottle, that's it. Now this is a trick I learned from the 6.5 guys, and I like spray lube, even for bottleneck rifle cartridges, because it goes on really quick. It takes a long time to roll cases or to spread something like imperial case sizing wax onto the case. Sometimes that's necessary, but even with 308 Winchester and difficult sizing applications like that, I found this type of lube to work really well, and it's really simple, and you can make it yourself. So let's do it, and then let's test it out. So here's how simple it is. All we need is a 10 to 1 ratio, 10 parts, 99% isopropyl alcohol. It's important to get 99% because if you get 70% or something like that, you've got a lot of water in there that you don't need. It's not going to dry as quickly. This alcohol is going to flash off super quick. The actual lubrication comes from the liquid lanolin. Don't worry, in my full write-up, just see the video description. I have links to all of the products so that you can make this lube yourself. This is literally, I just stole the bill of materials uh, from the 6.5 guys. And what I did here is this is a 16 ounce uh, spray bottle. And I've got 16 ounces of isopropyl alcohol. I need a 10 to 1 ratio, so I got to underfill here. And what I did is I just put a 4 inch line and a 0.4 inch line for 10 to 1. So I've got a small funnel here. I'm just going to open up my alcohol pierce the uh, foil. It's always a little bit of a bear. Okay, and we're just going to pour this in until we get up to our alcohol line. We can reuse this each time we uh, make up a batch here. All right, so there's our alcohol line. And then we're going to fill it with the lanolin. I might need a little bit of a help here to pierce the foil there. All right. Okay, so we now pour it until we're up to the lanolin line. And 6.5 guys said you can go a little under the 10 to 1 mark, so I'm going to call that good right there. Okay. We still have enough, looks like, for another batch. That's nice. We will let that drip out for a moment. Okay, and I'm going to call that good. Remove the funnel. Put our sprayer together here. Give it a kind of a gentle shaking motion here. And we're just going to keep doing that until we have a mixture. Okay, so we're pretty well mixed up there. Let's test it out. So I've got some test cases here. I'm just going to give them a squirt, make sure we get in the case mouse. Good. I'm going to squirt on one side, roll them a little bit, get the other side of the cases, and we will wait about five minutes and start sizing. Now it is time to size. Wow, <laughs> that is smooth as butter. The Mech Marksman is smooth as butter. The RAM is just super smooth, but this lube really really works well. Seems to work better than the Dillon DCL that I've been using for years. So I'm glad to make the switch. Thanks 6.5 guys, Ed and Steve, for the formula and the tip on this. I think it's going to make my life a lot easier. It's going to make the sizing a lot easier, that's for sure. So if you want an inexpensive lube that you can make at home, this is a great way to go. And like I said in the video description, I'm going to have all the info that you need to buy this stuff online and make it yourself. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you don't want to miss any of the action on ultimatereloader.com, please subscribe to my channel. Until next time, happy shooting and happy reloading.